With me is Pauline Craven, a member of the Mayor's Committee on Comfort. Pauline, it's no secret you recently had some complicated head surgery. So is there anything you could tell us that would ease the worries of prospective patients? <laughs> This is my friend Tom Kramer. And right here, well, this was my dad. You see, my dad saw something very special in Tom. I'll get back to that in a minute. You might also recognize some other faces in this photo. Yeah, my dad discovered them also. You're looking at the cast and crew of the late night live ABC television show Fridays. The year was 1980 and well, my dad knew how to find talented people. But Tom was even more special because at 20 years old, Tom was the youngest member of the crew. My dad hired him when he saw Tom's short comedy film called Nauseating Spasms. You saw a clip of it just a minute ago. Well, my dad saw it, loved it, and suddenly Tom found himself producing and directing a new film each week week for live television. Remember, he wasn't even old enough to have a beer yet. Can you imagine the pressure on this young 20-year-old? His short films would be introduced every single week on the show by Jack Burns, the host, and they became more and more popular. And Tom also gave me my very first production job, working the audio clapboard on one of his films. This is me right here on location. I got a free lunch that day for doing the clapboard job and an education you would never quite get in film school. Eventually the show went off the air and everyone moved on to other projects. Tom is now a television writer, director, and producer. He's directed and written many shows, such as HBO's Curb Your Enthusiasm, there he is right there, directing Larry David and Ben Stiller, or the awesome science Netflix series 100 Humans, or writing for Penn and Teller. However, Tom has been working on something else, something that not a lot of people are going to understand at first, but I think you will. And I think you're gonna learn from it. Ukulele, ukulele, pizma ukulele. Okay, some of you already know what's going on here. Deep down inside, like all of you, Tom is a creator. He's an artist. Whether it's writing, producing, directing, or creating performance art on YouTube, Tom has to create. One day he made a commitment that he would create a YouTube channel and produce one YouTube video every single week for no less than five years. One video a week for five years. The channel is called Pismo Ukulele, and it's 100% performance art in its finest. Tom's alter ego, Pismo, teaches ukulele tutorials, okay? Each tutorial is about three minutes long. The entire thing is just a goof, but Tom sits back and he watches the comments pour in. Nobody can quite understand why this channel exists. Why does he keep creating and publishing these videos week after week? Think of the discipline it takes to produce one complete video every single week for five years. And Tom doesn't get paid because he doesn't even have 1,000 subscribers yet, but he keeps on creating. Think of that scene in that Martin Scorsese directed segment in New York Stories, right? Where Rosanna Arquette is questioning the value of being an artist. Listen to what Nick Nolte tells her and remember that Martin Scorsese directed this. Could you just tell me if you think I'm any good? How about that? Just tell me if, if, if I have any talent or if you think I'm just wasting my time. What the hell difference does it matter what I think? It's yours. I mean, you make art because you have to, because you got no choice. It's not about talent. It's about no choice but to do it. You see, at heart, Tom is a creator. He's an artist, and he keeps on creating, and so are you. No more excuses. For those of you stuck in a slump, this is your wake-up call. Pick up your camera and start creating. We create because we need to. We create because we believe we can make something which we are calling our own. We create because we have to. And for Tom, it's Pismo Ukulele. Go watch one of his videos. It's art and comedy in its purest form. Now, Tom has no idea that I've made this video. I don't think he sees my channel very much, but I'm pretty sure he's going to see it. <laughs> and before he does, I want to tell you something and I want to ask you something. First, when my dad became ill and passed away about halfway through the show's season, Tom was a big part of what got me through it. You know, I've never told him that before. You know, 
going on his film shoots, watching him direct, helping him on location. It was just like I was part of that family. I felt like I was part of that family. And it was the Tom Kramer films that got me through that really rough time of losing my dad. Tom, thank you. And the second thing, Tom has, as of today, 635 subscribers. He's been creating these videos consistently every week, a few years now. Consistency in art is such a rare thing these days. I think it's time that he sees how awesome Pismo ukulele is to the world. I would love it if my audience could go over there and say hi to him. I'll have a link in the description. Hopefully we can do this before he sees this video. Just tell him that Chris says hi and give him some encouragement as the incredible producer, director, and writer that he is. Believe me when I say this, I can't think of another creator on the planet that would deserve those kind words more. Tom is a great guy and family to me. Just think, he only needs 365 more subscribers to get to 1,000. Oh, anyway, I want to thank you for being a part of today's very special Fast Friday. I will be on hiatus all of next week, but I will see you all in a brand new video on Wednesday, October 20th. I'm going to be signing off now. Have a wonderful weekend and all next week. And now I will close out today's video with Pismo's voice again. Whenever you're stuck creatively, whenever you feel like nobody's watching, you're trapped in your art, just remember that you have your Pismo somewhere inside of you. Create because you have to. Create because it's yours, and just keep creating. Ukulele, ukulele, pismo ukulele.